It is the nearest equivalent to the Stugna P. This weapon system was developed by the US Army during the Cold War to destroy Soviet armor, and now it is devastating Russian armor in Ukraine. These missiles were budgeted for $79,000 each in 2020. Tow anti-tank missiles are more lethal than Javelins, Stugnas, or Enlaw anti-tank missiles as they can penetrate up to 35-inch or 900 millimeters of RHA, rolled homogenous armor. So, with what tactics do the Ukrainians use these weapons in the field? Mostly, it goes like this. The lead vehicles of a Russian column were frequently heavily armored tanks. As a result, the Ukrainians used more advanced weapons with a higher kill probability to hit these tanks to ensure that the entire column came to a halt. Once a column was mobilized, Ukrainian forces could engage and destroy the vehicles sandwiched between the immobilized front and rear vehicles with less expensive weapons like AT-4s and RPG-7s.